Well, we are one week away today from the presidential debate between Vice President Kamala Harris and former President Donald Trump. And a group of voters watching these campaigns extremely closely is the young voter. 12 News journalist Justin Pizarro is joining us live in studio this morning. And Justin, you're really diving into a poll from young voters right here in Arizona. Yeah, it's very interesting. And there are a lot of issues facing the younger voter. One of them, of course, is housing. Will they ever be able to afford a home? And then there's the controversial war in Gaza. So during the Democratic National Convention in Chicago, there were huge protests outside that convention, which really showcased a key issue to a lot of young voters, what they care about. A really interesting poll came out by the New York Times Siena College, and it was conducted last month in six key swing states. And it shows men aged 18 to 29 favor former President Trump by 13 points. But then Vice President Kamala Harris had a 38 point advantage among women of the same age. That poll was done in Arizona, Michigan, Pennsylvania, Wisconsin, Georgia, and Nevada. People aren't here to throw their hands up, walk away, and let an 80 year old make decisions for them. I think that became clear. Well, now we've got new candidates. We've got a new hope. The more informed that they become, especially when it comes to their pocketbook, they become more conservative. So, of course, Arizona in general is a key state to win. Mr. Trump's running mate, J.D. Vance, is going to be in the valley tomorrow afternoon for a rally in Far East Mesa. Vice President Kamala Harris has not announced any event in our state just yet. Emily. We'll be watching, though. Justin, thank you.